A movement tonight against the Arizona Supreme Court justice to get this person off the bench. ABC 15, Steve Kuz is joining us now from downtown Phoenix. And Steve, what is the justice accused of? Some in the Republican Party, Katie, say that he ignored overwhelming evidence of fraud by allowing Proposition 121 to remain on the ballot. However, Justice John, <laughs> Justice John Palander told me that he has become the victim of party extremists who didn't get their way. For the past three years, Arizona Supreme Court Justice John Palander has ruled on some of the most important decisions in our state. They're somehow resting uh, the blame on, on me for the proposition being in the ballot, and that is just the furthest thing from the truth. If approved, Proposition 121 eliminates individual political party primary elections and instead sends the candidates with the most votes on to the general election. Tea Party Republicans hate it, saying thousands of invalid signatures were used to get it on the ballot in the first place. Palander agreed with an earlier ruling to keep the proposition on the ballot. And that's when the movement to unseat him began. Your feelings on Proposition 121 in no way affected how you ruled on this? Not at all. Not at all. It was simply not a factor. I have nothing against politicians or politics, but we as judges are not politicians, and we certainly do not decide any case this case included, based on political factors or personal policy preferences. Arizona's Republican Party leaders would not discuss the attacks against Justice Palander. This is not just a personal attack against me, but it's really a, a, an assault against the integrity of this court. And, and that bothers me greatly for obvious reasons. One major reason Justice Planter says he's been unfairly targeted is that as a state Supreme Court justice, it's not his job to decide if Proposition 121 should or should not remain on the ballot. It's his job to rule on whether or not the previous judge did his work correctly in allowing 121 to remain. Katie. Yeah, a system of checks and balances instead. Thank you, Steve.